Hello everyone, welcome to VLSI Simplified. In this special interview series, I will share with you the real question that were asked in my recent interview. So the goal of this series is to help you prepare better and get a clear understanding of the concepts that, that interviews love to ask. Let's begin to uh, with today's question. I will go one by one, explain the concept and also give you uh, some simple examples. Folk join. So one of the question was asked about folk join in system Marilog. The interview asked me to explain different types join, join any and join none. With join, the pairing waits until all threads complete. With join any, the pairing waits only until the first thread finishes. With join none, the pairing doesn't wait at all. And the child process continues in the background. This concept is very useful in test benches where parallel activities happen. Now, coming to deep copy versus shallow copy. Next, I was asked about deep copy and shallow gap copy. I explained that a shallow gap copy only copies the handle, so both objects point to the same memory. A deep copy creates a complete independent object with its own data. In verification, we often use deep copy for transaction to avoid data corruption. Then they asked me about static and automatic function. A static function keeps one storage for all calls. So value persists across calls. An automatic function creates a new storage each time which makes it re-entering and thread safe. In UBF test benches, automatic functions are the safer choice. Another question was the difference between new and this new. A new is used for single object while second new is used when you, you want to create an array of objects. For example, creating 200 packets object can be done with new uh, this one, second one of writing new first one 200 times. Assertion now. The last question was about assertion. I explained that immediate assertion checks a condition at a single point of time. Concurrent assertion checks timing relationship across cycles like ensuring if request comes, grant should come next cycle. Assertion are very important in verification interview. So these are some real interview question was asked and I hope my explanation help you understand the concept better.